In the vault. Okay, so the first little bit of top secret is uh, I think we're going to be ready to introduce a new type of segment soon. So we have chip shortage. But, you know, sometimes after a chip shortage, if there is such a thing, um, we'll eventually get parts, and these parts come on reels. So um, welcome to the real world. What happens when you put 5,000 parts on a reel and get it to Adafruit? The real world. <laughs> so so um, we have a little video. Um, we got a reel of parts. So uh, this is a product that's coming soon. You want to you wanna show it on the overhead real fast? Yeah. Um, I'm going to also show that video. Oh. Yeah. You know the one that we shot? Oh, yeah. Well, yeah. that's another part. But we yeah. got a reel of BNO 055s today. These are going in the pick and place tomorrow. You can see they were just made recently. Uh, thank you, Bosch. We asked them uh, in a previous um, chip shortage video to please, 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 Mr. Bosch, send us some. And they did. And um, we're going to crank out a bunch of BNO 055 breakout boards. We have a ton of orders. Um, you'll see these pop up at our favorite distributors. They've all placed back orders with us. Uh, and we would like to get them. Yeah. And uh, here's a video. Hi, Lady Ada. What is this? Hey, I'm testing out a breakout I designed for the TCA. 8418, it's a GPIO and keypad to I2T expander. It can do up to 80 keys. And I've got here hooked up a three by four keypad. I can like press buttons. Um, here's the page on uh, ti.com if you're interested and read more about it. And here is the output of my Python code. So as I press these buttons, you see it's like, hey, key up, key up, down, 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 down. And it has a Q, which is kind of neat, a 10 key Q. And then another thing is that there's an IRQ pen. And so I'm, I'm monitoring that with my scope. And every time I press a button, you, or it release a button, you see the IRQ go off. So uh, all this is good. This is working out. I've tested all the GPIO pens and the IRQ and the reset. So this is getting ready to go into the Adafruit shop soon. This is what happens when chips start shipping and start getting on reels. That's right. <laughs> so I'm paraphrasing. Well, I mean, I, I think, you know, and Bunny, I think, did a blog post or a tweet about this. There is a little bit of softening in the market right now. Um, there's parts that I had never been able to get before, and suddenly they're kind of available, like stuff that was backordered for a really long time is shipping. Um, so, you know, if you're if you're like, hey, I really needed a part and it wasn't available, um, go to DigiKey Search or search on your, you know, favorite uh, distributor um, or, or, you know, do a search for that kind of part that you're looking for. You might be surprised. I'm seeing not everything. Like some things are still totally unavailable, but there are more things available. Yeah. And then uh, another little bit of top secret. Um, I'll probably have a blog post. Maybe, s let's see, it's August right now, September. Um, we're going to start a thing where once a month we post some books that the team's reading or maybe some folks in the community. We're calling it Book Fruit. Book Fruit. Um, because uh, I send emails to, f to friends and, and in our meetings here at Adafruit and over our Slack and all this stuff. Oh, what book are you reading? What book are you reading? So this is Book Fruit. We'll do it like a hashtag. I'm stealing this from Book Talk. And uh, the book that I'm reading uh, right now, I'm almost finished with it, is, uh, let me go to this, uh, Existential Physics with uh, Sabine Hassenfelder, also an excellent uh, singer, by the way. So if you like physics, it's kind of a good one, just came out. Um, and uh, right before that, I think I was reading, I read the Benjamin Franklin biography, because I, I think I read it a long time ago, but I forgot if I did. So those are the two. Um, and then we're gonna have, of course, you know, electronic books and more, but anyways, I thought that'd be kind of cool. And uh, I'll let everybody know when they can, uh, you know, send us or tag what book they're reading. Um, kind of like a maker book club engineering book club. And that's top secret.